My name is Hernan Gonzalez. I'm a counsel at White and Case in Mexico City. Uh, my practice include energy, infrastructure, and project finance, uh, along with other infrastructure sectors. A series of important legal events have occurred recently in Mexico. Back in December 2013, a constitutional groundbreaking reform was approved by Congress through which the energy sector was open for the first time in many years for private participation. In August 2014, Congress approved a series of secondary laws through which the constitutional reform was implemented, opening the sectors of oil, gas, electricity, and other energy-related industries. The new laws made significant changes because until now, important industries such as oil, gas, and electricity were only conducted through state-owned companies. For example, in the oil and gas sector, it was Petróleos Mexicanos, or otherwise known as Pemex, the state-owned entity in charge of carrying out all of the activities related to such industry. On the other hand, in the power sector, state-owned company, Comisión Federal de Electricidad, or CFE, was the entity in charge of conducting all the power-related activities. The situation in Mexico has changed as a result of the new laws in a way that now the activities that were previously conducted only by Petróleos Mexicanos or Pemex will now be able to be undertaken by Mexican and non-Mexican private companies. Similarly, in the power sector, the activities that were before this reform reserved to the state-owned company, CFE, will now be able to be undertaken by private companies, Mexican and non-Mexican. Private companies, Mexican and non-Mexican companies, will be attracted by these changes in the recently approved law because there are going to be a number of industries previously closed in which they will be able to participate now. For example, power generation and marketing, uh, distribution and transmission to the extent is carried out through contracts, as well as oil and gas related activities, including exploration and production. 